North Penn High School, a school that has over 3,000 students attending grades 10 through 12. A school that feels almost as big as a college campus. But North Penn wasn't always like this. Many people don't even know the true history behind this high school. I'm not talking about the current high school building built in 1971. I'm talking about the true history of North Penn High School. During the 19th century, schools were very small and many school districts only consisted of one actual school, and many of the schools lacked the ability to provide a full education to students. During the 1940s, lawmakers knew that something needed to be done. Around, uh, right after World War II, uh, there were several things that happened that made uh, the state of Pennsylvania and other states also realize that all these little local school districts were not adequate to meet the needs of education for students uh, in grades 7 through 12. And so the states, like Pennsylvania, began to encourage school districts to consolidate and for smaller districts to come together and make large jointures. Um, most school districts were reluctant to do that. And so there were incentives that were offered that were financial, and that did en encourage some, but not all. By 1949, um, seven school districts in this area, including Lansdale, Hatfield, North Wales, Montgomery, Lyme, Lexington, Tom Manson, Upper Gwynedd, Low, not Lower Gwynedd, just Upper Gwynedd, came together and decided to talk about joining together. And they did not um, initially decide to do it uh, all at once. But then by the 1950s, that did become uh, more of a reality. North Penn High School is a combination of three local high schools, Hatfield High School, Lansdale High School, and North Wales High School. Hatfield High School, located on Main Street in the middle of Hatfield, consisted of only 300 students. Well, from what I understand, when the school was opened in uh, 1922, it was considered uh, one of the finest educational uh, buildings between Philadelphia and Allentown, so uh, it was quite the showpiece for, for Hatfield. Even with the building being small, students still enjoyed the building until 1955 when classes moved to the new high school on Penn Street. After Hatfield High School closed, the building became an elementary school and then became a small college in the years to follow. The second school that joined North Penn was North Wales High School located on Summer Street and was built in the year 1928 to replace the small and outdated school from the 1890s. This building is now North Wales Elementary School. The third school was Lansdale High School, located on Penn Street and was built around the year 1914. This school was also a smaller school. The high school was built to combine students from the Greenhouse School, which burnt down due to a fire on Christmas Eve, and to replace the outdated Broad Street School around the 1890s. As time went on, people knew something needed to change but many were skeptical about the ideas being brought to the table. When state legislators brought up the plan to either join together to form one bigger school or lose complete government funding, communities knew that losing government funding wasn't an option. So by the year 1955, the decision was made to make the school Lansdale High School the new North Penn Senior High, combining Hatfield, North Wales, and Lansdale High Schools into one. In the North Penn Joint School System, we're extremely proud of our classroom teachers, our principals, and our service staff. Many things were changing, changing for the better. North Penn Senior High became the iconic place to be. Of course, the activities were a whole lot different. We didn't have a million, you know, nobody, nobody even knew what lacrosse was or some of these other things that were going on. We had football, baseball, there was some tennis and there was basketball, and there was track and cross country. And that was, that was really just about all there was. North Penn Senior High was one of the best and biggest schools in the area. The school was known all over the state for having one of the most advanced education systems of the 1950s.
the North Penn complex is rich in the finest educational traditions. There are many excellent facilities. North Penn Senior High School is a good example of learning at its best. Modern buildings and airy, bright classrooms set the scene for study. A staff of top flight instructors keep standards high. The school was also known for having a large high school social life with over 700 students attending the school. But as North Penn continued to grow rapidly, by the year 1971, the school became overcrowded and a new school was built in Talmensen Township. The school took over three years to build and over $100,000 to complete the entire project. The new school gave students many new opportunities with a fully operational planetarium and new swimming pool added to the building. And to this day, things are still being added and changed. North Penn has been through a lot, but the reason still has never changed. Dream big and achieve greatness. North Penn High School.